Hey, this is Nick Logan, and as Jim Rohn would say, we have a chance as human beings to participate in the miracle process, changing someone's life, rescue them from oblivion, building an organization second to none, uh, so that your name will appear in many people's testimonials. <clears throat> and my dream is that someday you would say, hey, I met Nick Logan, and that uh, started me down the road to success. Um, I personally have always been a seeker. I'm uh, constantly looking for ways to grow. A few years back, I heard of a, a concept from Jim Rohn that I took to heart, and uh, that is you must work harder on yourself than you do on your business. I, I hardly had to read uh, any books when I was in, in high school or even college, and that sure changed in a hurry immediately following gra graduation. I was waiting tables, but I had the magic piece of paper that said, hey, I'm a bachelor in psychology. Woohoo! <laughs> Needless to say, that was an eye-opener. Um, I've read a hundred times more books than I ever read in college and that led me to Brian Tracy and I came across Success Mastery. Brian Tracy recorded a weekend seminar that is uh, pretty much the most, in my opinion, the most complete and scientific approach to success and mindset out there. I think I paid either $97 or $197 for uh, a few years back and uh, it was well worth it. And I listen to this program over and over, and it's made, me, made a huge difference in, in my, my success in my business. So I wanted to share a little bit with it today. People from all over the world come to the United States with nothing to declare at, at customs and move on to have great success. Brian Tracy speaks of a, a gentleman from Korea named John Woo. Um, John, John Woo came to this country with nothing to declare and built a billion-dollar company within 12 years. And... Uh, with nothing but his mind and ambition. And as Jim Rohn would say, uh, becoming a self-made millionaire is wonderful for the money purpose, but it's the person you have to become that's the most important of all. To become an exemplary person financially, you must become an exemplary person. And as you're thinking about how you wish you could do, do that, you're, you're really going to become interested in finding out how easy it is to have success online today. And uh, Brian Tracy studied the law of correspondence. So the law of correspondence states, as within, so without. So your outer world is a ref reflection of your inner world. And everything you have in your life, you have because of the person you are on the inside. And your relationships, your finances, your debt, your wealth, your anger, etc. Wherever you go, there you are. And if you can change what's going on on the inner world, you can dramatically change what's going on in the outer world. And there is no other way. Successful people are very clear on where they're going and what they want. And unsuccessful people are very fuzzy and confused. Brian Tracy does a great job in Success Mastery scientifically approaching this topic. The flip side is there is no other way. You cannot change the outer world without changing what is going on inside of you. That means you have a... a a huge opportunity to accomplish great things by working on yourself and you have total control you cannot be angry unhappy frustrated and ignorant on the inside and have a happy fluent successful life on the outside and you cannot change the external world so um, why are some people more successful than others and um, the, the Bible says seek and you shall find for all who seek findeth and the future belongs to the seekers and uh, more on Brian Tracy uh, tomorrow. See you then. Look at it.